Are we rolling? Are we ro okay, good. It's uh, Jeff Edwards coming to you from downtown Eureka. Well, I did this before. Not really Eureka, but it's the town that plays Eureka, Chilliwack, BC. And today we got a bit of a bit of a coup. We're going to be able to talk to the executive producer and creator of Eureka. We're going to find him somewhere down here on the set this morning. Come on with us. Eureka premiered on the Sci-Fi Channel in 2006. The series takes place in a fictional town called Eureka, Oregon. It was created by Andrew Cosby and Jamie Paglia. Jamie, how are you doing? I'm doing great. Executive producer, creator of the series, writer on the series. Um, well, it's it's pretty much the coolest job ever. I mean, as you can see behind us, we're limousines, we're blowing things up. It's uh, it's pretty, it's it's, it's a, an amazing opportunity, really. Where were you before this series took off? What were you doing? Uh, I mean, I started off in feature film publicity at MGM Pictures, and um, I had been writing in college, and then I uh, was working for a producer in development for a while, and then uh, as I became more frustrated with the process, went back to writing, and uh, with a partner of mine, I sold a feature film, and then that led to another feature, and then that led to Eureka. So I've sort of been my full-time job for about seven years now. Seven years seems to be kind of a magic number. If you can, if you can hang on for seven years, is that is that sort of the way you see it in the business too? Um, it certainly takes time. I mean, I think that uh, I was uh, writing a lot and uh, learning the in, you know how the industry worked from the inside out. And it took the first job I got, which was as a you know production assistant, sort of a uh, publicity assistant in feature films, and. Um, that gave me at least a, a kind of a gauge on how everything was working, but I was always right, and it, uh, ultimately um, I had more opportunities because I was meeting people and trying to figure out how everything worked. How long ago did you come up with the story idea? It's funny, uh, you know, I co-created the show with a buddy of mine, Andy Cosby, and I think that it was sort of a blend of our sensibilities. It was one of those things that I was, I grew up in a small town in the Pacific Northwest. I mean, for me, this was definitely uh, um, a familiar territory, those those dynamics, and um, we sat down. And we were, we had an opportunity to to work in television potentially, and, and um, it was like, what 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 kind of show would I want to do? And for me, I, I, it was Northern Exposure was kind of my touchstone. I really yeah. loved the dynamics and those characters and the sensibilities, and it was funny and real and grounded and um, you know sort of emotional, and you felt like you really knew that town and those people. So. Don't tell anybody, but we're really in downtown Chilliwack, British Columbia. We are. We are. How did, how did Chilliwack end up getting the part? Well, you know, we we boy, we searched everywhere for. Uh, first of all, obviously, there's the practicality of it. it needs to be somewhat close to Vancouver Film Studios so that we can actually bring our our stuff out here. But as you can see behind me, you know, we've got well, across the street, we've got we've got Cafe Diem over here. And we've got uh, sort of park down here, and you'll see if you uh, move it down here, there's uh, the, the flats in front that make up our, our police station and sort of city hall. Those things we have to truck in every time, as you know, yeah. uh, when we come down here. And that's no small expense, so it has to be something that's transportable for us. Um, so we, we looked at, at, at towns all over the place, but we wanted something that had, um, you know, vistas of mountains in the background that would really give you that Pacific Northwest feel and a nice sort of central town square kind of feel to it, even though we're kind of building it up a little bit. Um, so uh, Chilliwack, that was okay. Man, thanks so much for doing this. I know you're hey, very busy, and, and I don't want to keep you from your lunch any longer, but uh, no, it's my pleasure, pleasure meeting you. You too. Thanks. Bye, guys.